what's going on tubers team alpha task force here gonna go over my medical bug out bag uh, it's gonna be an addition inside the bug out bag uh, so it is June the 15th Tuesday and we're gonna go over what I have as far as contents and uh, some things to talk about now this is not a complete medical kit but it's what I'm rolling with right now so first things first let's talk about the bag um, it looks like a uh, it's an actual like emergency car bag looks like a tool bag and it's not really that waterproof but it is supposedly waterproof however I put everything inside this uh, car cover that is waterproof bag this little mini car cover uh, it's for your car uh, when you cover up your car this little travel bag comes with it so you can wrap the car cover inside of it and like throw it in the trunk but I never do that with my car cover so I put all the actual medical supplies inside here and then I seal it up with these little elastic rings here and I put it inside the bag this goes inside my actual bug out bag and it compacts so I can fit it in there now I have a large capacity in there but it's made for whatever I need and it fits perfectly inside there uh, as always you need to take all your medical plans your bug out you know plans your maps and all that stuff and we put it together to our MA project this right here is actually a listing of all the emergency readiness the maps that we need of our whole situation anything that we need to go through it's all in here and this stays in their house but we are well trained in this and we know what to do when a situation comes up but I'll go over this in another video so anyways what is inside the actual medical bag let's start over here um, as you can see alcohol swabs am antiseptic wash hydro I don't even know what to say, the peroxide solution. Um, you got this uh, cool aloe burn spray in case you get burns. Uh, I got calamine lotion, neosporin, uh, tissues, new skin, and in case you get like a deep cut, I'm going to seal it up with that. Um, thick gloves, uh, multiple uses for paper bags, thick gloves, um, you know, some, some uh, adhesive bands and some, what is that? Uh, looks like hydrocortisone cream. It's in a waterproof bag. It's kind of nice. Four by fours. I got a little kit here. It's like a nail kit. Um, it's got little scissors, clippers, and whatnot. I got bandage gauze, um, sewing kit, three by threes, emergency survival blanket, um, a thing of clear tape here. But see, this clear tape is I get it in rolls. Uh, and I get different kind of like microfiber, microspore, clear tapes. But uh, I always get this because you can take this up with the, the gauze bandages around your arm and call it good. Always want to bring some water with you. Gotta, gotta keep some water. Um, these right here are some glucose tabs, you know, in case you need it. It's, you know, get your sugar level up and give somebody else's level uh, for diabetics. More gauze banding in a roll. I got a ear loop mask. You never know who you're going to meet out there, whoever you need in your bug out group or you know somebody's got some kind of uh, infection you want to get it cold ice pack I got a homemade kind of tourniquet uh, wrap here for my mom she's in she's a nurse and she kind of taught me that bunch of arm bands leg bands you can you know wrap yourself up in a sling um, got q-tips uh, this right here is just like a grocery bag uh, so you can put your, your waist when you're done you know using all these dressings and non-stick dressings and gauze bags they all come in like little packets of paper and uh, just band-aids adhesive bags I got a series of different uh, like holds and cuts for you know when you're wrapping slings up and gauze and all that you want to hold it you know with without using your hand that's what the medical professionals do um, to cut off clothing got that mini scissors for flush cuts um, pad and paper, you can record like uh, respiration, you know, different heartbeats or anything you need to pass on medically. Whistle. I just got this cool uh, little knife here. It's a boot knife from 511. Uh, I was thinking about putting it in the medical bag. You never know. So that's kind of cool. It hangs on your neck too, so you can kind of alter that so you can carry it. And I always carry a knife in there too. So this is kind of like my uh, medical bug out uh, section of it. And we'll see what goes on. I'll, I'll keep growing it and uh, try to make it more user friendly to help other people too. Because you never know, you know, who needs it or where this comes from. But, uh, you know, just keep making more videos and, you know, help me out. If you see something that I forgot, you know, always comment on it. Let me know. 
But uh, this is just something that I thought you might want to, you know, throw in your bag. Of course, I keep all this in my car, and it's ready to bug out whenever. So thank you for watching, and keep watching some more videos for Team Out Potential.